Yeah, in lots of ways it was hard to um, not uh, re-sign for another season with the Magic. I think in other ways it was easy um, when I looked at um, what I'd already um, done, the time I'd spent here, and I think there was a part of me that just wants to know what life is like away from netball, and the hard thing is leaving the people and um, knowing that I won't be here next year, so about this time of year you start to think about the next year and the planning, and um, it's a little bit of a, a reality check when you realise you're not going to be there. That's where I'm from, it's where I live, it's where my family is, where my support networks are, and it's the only franchise I've been with. The magic has always been about that heart and the family values and just really humble, hard-working people. Metcalf looking nice ball across to Van Dijk. Earliest memories playing of Magic were not actually very good. Um, we weren't very successful, but I think in the early 2000s it all started to turn around and um, you know we got some great coaches and Ruth Aiken and Nolan Todua and yeah we just didn't look back from there, really enjoyed winning a couple of championships, the very first ANZ Premiership um, final which we made in 2008. Yeah, those are all pretty cool memories. Some of my favourite moments coaching, I think Last year, when that was a really tough COVID-impacted um, year, I really enjoyed um, when we won the, the few games that we did because it was a real struggle. We've had some lots of close games, a couple of draws, I think. Um, and so to come away with those wins is always memorable. And then I, I guess the, the game where Casey Corpo had the stadium named after her was another first for the franchise and for a pretty special player who also was really loyal to the Magic. And I reckon going to take some more short of those short squares and the player coming towards us. I think coaching is the best bit is going to training and working with the players and seeing them develop and grow, not just on the court but as people. And when you can bring a group of sometimes strangers together and see them at the end being close friends um, and really loving being in that team together, I think, yeah, that's what makes it special. Look, I think it's been a really tough season for us um, on the scoreboard, but um, the best thing about this team this year is how resilient they are, how positive they've remained, um, how connected they are with each other. Um, they're a lot of fun to be around. They um, have never had a victim mentality or a blame mentality. They really just um, look very much at how we can be better and how we can improve, and every week they turn out ready to go again and with hope that um, you know the outcome might be different. So, yeah, I think that's really helped us all get through. Regardless of whether I'm here in a playing or coaching capacity, um, I'll always be a big supporter and uh, yeah, really wish the franchise all the best for the future.